we're talking about respo responding to this video quote from Squid that uh, why he hates Black Clover, why sh Black Clover shouldn't exist. We're going to talk about all the points that he says. We're going to debunk them. Broku is going to debunk debunk them as well. And so I'm joined with Sakura, uh, Bok so Sakura right here. <laughs> check yeah. out check out his channel. I edit his thumbnails. I uh, do other shit <laughs> with him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, just check that out. It's gonna be link in the description. It's right there. Uh, try to get him up to how many subscribers you want? Which one? Uh, try to get him to three hundred subscribers. That's uh, three hundred subscribers. Yeah, try because I don't have any <laughs> <more> subscribers. <laughs> yeah. So could be first off, we're gonna talk about um, Asta, like because Asta. I get the many reasons why people dislike him. That's fine. And when we're talking about Black Clover. Everybody has a subjective opinion, but you can't just automatically use the argument that also yells so much like that's like taking things out of context and ignoring some nuance to his character. Or saying he's just a plain character, he has no special word to like something like special to him, like if he has a, uh, what's it, a gum gum through and he stretches, uh, Goku has the same powers and that and like many more other the main characters have a certain power, but with Asta, he has anti-magic. Just... Yeah, and anti-magic is his own thing. It's special and unique to him. And one thing that proper pissed me off, and what I will say, I'm going to say in the top, like, after this Asta bit right here, like, when he talked about the Wizard King, saying that's lame and that, like, but like you said in early on, like, One Piece and Naruto had uh, the Hokage and the, he wants to be the Pirate King. Why the Wizard King is plain to him then? Every shonen has a basic goal. Yeah, and in general, you can argue that not all shonen characters can be all the same, but Asta, the reason for becoming the Wizard King is to basically point out the hypocrisy in his society and the difference between the commoners and the nobles treating each other like shit and how the system is messed up. Yeah, saying that, when he said about the world be world in a shit, it, it's not shit. Like, like I said in the Instagram group chat, they can't like touch on that right now without the anime and the manga. Because they, first off, the anime is on the training arc, and the manga is at the time skip arc. They can't touch on that, like right now. Yeah. Since so most it. of the animators are basically busy, and to, and Yuki Tabata has some work to do. You can still criticize the world building to some extent if there's consistencies or a retcon, which there isn't. Yeah, the thing is, I know, I get what they, where he's coming from, but... For, yeah. Um, do you keep Tabata on a saga with the elf arc, with all their multiple arcs linking to the elf arc? First off, and then he went to the Heart Kingdom arc, then he went to the dark, the time skip arc. There's no, uh, you can see there's world building in between there that, but it hasn't been focused on because it ha will have a separate arc in that. You can, with you, you true in that. Like, well, you got any other opinions in that about the world building in that? Uh, I don't have no other opinions in general. He could have just explained it a lot more clearer and basically remove his bias and then explain further on. Talk about in the Grim Wars, like I went blooming ballistic on the Instagram. Blooming ballistic on the Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first off, the Grim Wars. Uh, East Squid said, oh, the, the Grim Wars didn't choose the group partners properly. Like, yes, they did. They chose them for particular reasons. Talk about the ability, choose them about the magic type, chose them for a reason. Get what I mean? They don't like choosing without the reason. If they didn't choose out the, without the reason, what's the plot point of the plot of the stories? What's the point of the story? Black Clover didn't exist if that happened then. Grim Wars is a big part of yeah. the whole story though. The big part. That's how they use magic, how they use cast spells, how they use their mana properly and that. Yeah, I agree since if he, if Asa was just given to his book like everybody else in the whole kingdom was the point of the actual story. It chooses its owner in general. Second, then go and then go along with the Grimoire bit, the Five Leaf Grim War that um was it Asta gained that. Okay, I get where you said he was given about it, but I think there was more to the 
bit more to it by giving special without the uh, magic thing, because as has no magic and. The only th he got the fight for the green grimoire without any contract with the de demon or anything like that. Because uh, you can the anti magic or blah blah blah. Um, like you can't say he gained it with for no reason. You can't say that. Okay, he gained it for because he has no magic and the anti magic. He can only wield it and wield the swords and that. So, I think there's more reasons to it, because we haven't got revealed properly to the anti-magic demon, why he chose that stuff, blah blah blah, and all of that shit. You got any, like, like, you get what I mean, like, you can't, you can't say you've been given that power to him. Like, Asta in the moment was almost about to get killed in the first chapter, and he actually protect you know, and prove that he can make a change through himself. And that's when the Grimoire chose him for that important reason. It's not like he's be given giving it to it. That's me. Like Squid has been watching the videos, just been watching, haven't been using his brains or his using his eyes when he was born with them to focus on each episode. Like you could tell with these small details. Yeah. <sighs> well, I like. <laughs> okay, now this has pissed loads of people from. The video, Gr Grosh, the pedophile bit. Why would you say that? Why would you? <laughs> like the goose thing, I get many people like go around saying, oh, he's a pedophile. Any black core fan who stands him is a pedophile. Like, dude, just chill out. I understand the siscon thing, but I don't think it goes in that way. And even in later on in the story, it's not like that. Yeah. So, like, um, talk about that. There's reasons why he's attached to his sister. There's reason why he's no police because the backstory, the backstory. Because those royals ruined their life, killed the parents, stole their home. They got kicked out the home. He protected the sister. He was attached to his sister. This is why he's like that. After like, this is why he's like that to his sister. Like, oh, look at my sister. What's his, What's her sister's name again? Let me see. Merrily. I think goes to sister is I can't remember. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> I think it's good getting with Mer Merrily something like that. Like you can't say you can't okay, you can't say he's a pedophile, but you like see there's backstory to it. You can't like you can tell he hasn't been focusing at all. He's been focused as a character and is very protective. He kinda has that sister slash brother complex you see in anime but it's not like incestual like like talking about like going back to Asa's plain character like no like like no i get there's like many arguments for it but Asa isn't like a plain character in general it's just that many people try to use that the bata uses tropes even though tropes help you develop that character and create him as a unique protagonist in his own series by that argument we will be saying every character from every fictional story is playing and has the same exact goal yeah it's like nobody was complaining about the screaming bit that's part of his personality you can't yeah <laughs> you, you can't go up to someone in public or oh, stop screaming and then they, they're gonna feel so sad they can feel depressed and all of that you can't say that like you know like, there's me because I, I tell you that, I'm, I was going about to make a video about this, I'm going to talk about like semi-detail. No one believed in Asta at the start. No one, except Nero. That's like when he, she stayed with Asta like the whole time. No one believed, no one believed in Harsh Village. You know didn't believe in him to become a Wizard King and all of that. Why, why, how he's a plain character when no one believed in him? There was build up to a character, there was things to the character, there was detail about the coward. No one believed in him. Yes, it's even, he said Asta never trained or did none of this, even though they show us multiple times, even in the first couple of episodes that he trained and gained superhuman strength. Like, what are you talking about? He literally busted his ass getting strong. It wasn't for magic. There's something called Ki in the Black Clover universe, so similar to Dragon Ball but it's more physical and more focused. Talking about that, you know with the key bit, he learned 
T in one hour. Oh wait, yeah, yeah, in one day, in one day. And Yami took like maybe three years to master that. Three yeah years. And saying that, if he didn't train his body, he couldn't wield the swords at all. He couldn't wield it because it's too heavy. Because you know, what's it? Julia was struggling in that. Was struggling lifting the sword. He was struggling with the swords, but he had to get used to it. He he wasn't like all that powerful, and he wasn't like one shining everybody at once in the first start. If he did, there wouldn't be no tension, and Asta almost got killed on separate occasions. Yeah, like with Fetu's fight, he thank God he trained his body for that. Thank God, because he yeah. both his arms, he got cursed both his arm, and he still fought with both curses and broken arms. That's how powerful he is. That's how he's not a plain character. If he's a plain character, he'd be dead straight away from that. Yeah. <laughs> this video, when we were responding to it, was pretty funny and a bad take. <laughs> Alright, I don't know if this guy is a troll. I know he said he watched about 120 plus episodes of it, but if he watched all of this, he should have basically know all of this at once. I don't know if he's a troll or just being information creating this pseudo misconception. Like talk about huh? Like you know when he's talked about the thinner all oh, the thinner's bad and all of that, like no it's not, it's canon to the story. It, it Yeah. It's canon to the story. It shows a bit thing. Like episode 125, you know when they found uh the the broken base and they had to find the magic beasts. That is canon. Mm -hmm. It wasn't canon in the manga because it wasn't featured in the manga, but it's canon to the story because the building was broken from the elf the elf attack, and the magic beasts are canon to the story as well because you have seen it in countless times in the manga and the anime. Yeah. Like what else do you is basically about that? Like, it's basically oh. like Tabata just makes. He is the mangaka of the original source material, but he helps Perry out and some of the writers add more filler material, not much. It's about at least a small percentage to make it canon so it can make sense in the actual story, which wasn't added in the manga, but makes it canon in the secondary source material. I don't know where he's getting, like, you could tell he hasn't focused on the episodes or haven't focused on the anime at all. He's just been watched in like the in two days and like oh this is shit yeah <laughs> like what else did he like talked about and all of that because i know he talked about like uh gross as pedophile as the main character um the grim wars uh, animation yeah oh i, I get I can, I can okay i could disagree with the animation time to time i could i i, I could i can let that off but with some episodes with good directors, the animation is crispy clean. Yeah, since Tatsuya, who who mainly does the animation for other animes like Faith, comes on and basically draws most of the scenes and fight scenes that are established. Even some animators that are lower are barely mentioned, but they do a consistent job with the later seasons and the animation. Yeah, the animation is clunky. But it's not the best, and most of the animators have a lot of things to do. Yeah, like, because you can, like, Studio Power Out, like, how many series they have to do a week? Maybe, like, 20 plus series. They can't keep up with good animation every single day. They work 24 hours a day, they get paid less, their arms are flipping tired every single day. Yeah, since animators don't get paid much in Japan, and sometimes it's not easy being an animator. There are, there are general criticism of it, but most of the animators have 500 plus anime and studios that are contracted to them. So they can just automatically make good animation. There's always going to be a mess up or a slip up in animation. It always happens to every single anime, except like, except, like some good anime like studios like the animation is like crispy clean like Jojo for example because they're like it's seasonal it's seasonal and the anime yeah like I don't because I don't what own studio is because like I don't I haven't heard of the studio before and I don't think they have animated that many shows before like 
David Productions, yeah, like, horrible. Yeah, because it's like you can't like you like people's comparing like for like say JoJo for like season animes against long long running shonen anime. Like how the blimmin' hell would you compare that? Once they compare the animated every seasonal, they on point every single animation. The point long running. Some people is probably damaged arm, broken arm. Arm is screwed up after animating over and over again. Cause like if you see like how how animated animators do their like animation, that they draw paper over paper. Yeah, and also do animation backgrounds and a setup for the battle while having blueprints to show the previous work and then they get the secondary animators on to do the main focus of the battles and camera cinematography so you can enjoy the fight. Okay, I was like, I was proper pissed right here, like, I don't think I have anything else to say. Do you uh, have anything else to say? No, I don't have anything else. Okay, thank you for watching. Make sure you check out Soccer right now. It's the link in the description or my channel's subscription page says YouTube friends or the pinned comments down below. Come and get into 300 subscribers. If you don't, I'll bloom and kill you all. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> but, <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, make sure you subscribe to me because I upload random junk of anime and manga. <laughs> Turn the notifications <laughs> of me and him as well. Like the video, like comment any like like any feedback because I greatly appreciate it. Yeah, and see you in the next video. Peace out.